Hey guys, and welcome back to Skies of Arcadia. When we last left off, we were in the temple, and uh, yes, things were progressing fairly well. Let's knock down this door anyway, and see what lies within. Pretty sure we managed to collect everything from um, our last adventure. Okay, that was weird. Oh, hello. I was going to say, there was no door sound effects. Ooh, you are one ugly motherfucker. Let me guess. Your weakness is water. Okay. I'm not sure if we need what we've got in the way of water spells. But we have everybody using water crystals anyway. So, let's have a little look at our magic, shall we? Um... So, large tornado, whirlwind of air and water. That might do some damage. Let's give it a go, shall we? Uh, you. Uh, you've got the same spell. Let's just hit him with this, see what happens. Uh, and I guess we're out of... Uh, we'll just go for an attack. Moons, get me straight. I would have thought... 67 damage. Ooh, okay. That probably, ouch, is not worth it. The rock worm. Okay, we're learning. That's okay. We'll go for a direct attack. Oh, okay. She does significantly more. Probably because uh, Vase is shit when it comes to magic. So Fina needs to stick with that. Uh, what we could do, actually... Uh, we could go for Delta Shield. Hmm. Creates an anti-magic shell around all allies. But it only lasts for one turn, though. So, uh, I don't know. We could try Alpha Storm on the bastard. See what that does. Now, Fina, actually, is kind of more powerful when it comes to magic. So, let's see what she can do. I'm guessing... Yeah, that's not going to do anything. So that is a fire-based attack. Okay. I thought it was. Explains quite a few things. Yeah, standard attack from Vase. Ooh, they counter. Ooh, he's got a counter attack. Little bastard. This would be interesting. Ooh, 155 damage. Yeah, so using that is definitely better. Uh, right, so go on then. We're going to go straight in. And you know what? What's that? The cure's one of your... Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Let's get Delta Shield going. Because I'm wondering if that's going to protect us against his... Um, fire Breath. It should do. Should at least help. Yeah, we're, we're going to win the battle of attrition. Kind of. Obviously, it's not going to do a lot against his counter-attack. But that's okay. He might have to do a round of healing soon. Yeah, Cinderstorm. Ooh. Okay, I mean, he's not exactly doing as much damage. Ah. Ah. Ha. Yeah. Ah. Uh, mmm. Okay. That's problematic. Do we have anything that cures stone? Uh, revive an ally to max HP. I don't think we do. No. Okay. In that case. In that case, let's just attack as normal. Um... You have magic, though. That will cure all... Yeah, okay. So we can use that. That's fine. That'll work. Okay, so her attacks aren't actually doing too bad damage either. Volcanic Blast. Oh, this is going to be nasty, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, that's pretty sucky. All right, let's get Vi's back. There we go. Or Vi's back. 
Alright, he's feeling a little bit better now. Everybody just use... So that's the 500. We do have... 1,000 health. Right, use that. Uh, you could probably get away with using one of those. And you... Oh god, yeah, you desperately need to use one of them. We need to buy some more of those. Definitely. <clears throat> Let's, try this. Let's try this. There we go. I think we're going to have to start saving up Let's to use this. some ultimate attacks. Much better. Pulled back from the brink there. Oh, this volcanic blast. It's just savage. Yeah, 500 damage. Ooh, good lord. That hurts. That really hurts. Right, let's go for... Let's go for Cutlass Fury. Uh, and you... Keep that healing coming. No, there's no point using that. You might as well use that. Uh, what I want you to do... Um, Silver Moonlight cleanses all... Uh, no. Yeah, we want some regeneration, but obviously we can't use that. Silver Moon to damage and possibly stone a single enemy. Yeah, I very much doubt we can stone him. Not really worth trying. Um, right, in that case, just have a crystal. Let's try this. Right, that's uh, Vay's feeling a little bit better. And he can go for another Cutlass Fury. Yeah, that's good. That's worth it. Definitely worth going for. Cinderstorm. Oh, God. It's going to freeze. Oh, don't freeze her. Nope, she didn't stone. That's good. That would have sucked. At least having such a low amount of health doesn't take uh, the good stuff to heal her. Oh, should we actually? Let's just go for another round of normal attacks. Yeah, normal attacks. Actually, Ika could probably. Yeah, normal attack. You, I want you to eat one of those crystals. You, I want you to cast Lunar Blessing, just so we can keep everybody topped up. To some degree. Give us your blessing. Yes. Yeah, definitely want that regen. Let's try this. I mean, it's not amazing, but it's nice to have it, uh, you know, giving us a little bit of health each turn. Come on, don't stone. Good. Yeah, 200 health per turn. That's not bad. Okay, so let's go for another round of attacks. And then we should be able to unleash some vengeance in the next turn. I mean, counterattack is null and void now. Because the amount of he uh, health we're regening. So, that's fine. Yeah. Okay, that hurts, but... Cinderstorm. Don't Cinderstorm phase. Good. There we go. Yeah, that regen is going to be helpful as fuck. It, what would be nice is if we get a better version of it, which we probably do. So we don't have to focus on healing so much now. Nice. That is a good chunk of damage. We should be able to do that Cutlass Fury almost every turn, fingers crossed. Yeah, we're really not... Oh, God. This is the one that hurts. This hurts. As long as he doesn't do that every single turn as well, we should be fine. Nice. Nice. Okay, yes, Cutlass Fury again. Everybody else, just chip away. 
might not be able to do Cutlass Fury next turn. Oof. That's it. Just keep draining him down. Little by little. Ah, dude. He's not feeling so good now, is he? There you go, you big bastard. Oh, God. No. She's okay. No, she's stoned. Fuck. Uh, one second. Guys, I have a phone call. And we're back. Sorry about that, guys. Okay, we were continuing our rounds of uh, punishment on these guys. Let's go for... Yes. Let's go for another round of attacks, I think. Build up some points. Actually, I could probably could have used a hill, but... Ooh, yeah, that might have been bad. Oh, nice. Well done, Vase. Oh, critical. Oh, you beast. That's what we're talking about. Nice bit of healing there. Uh, right, hit him with a Cutlass Fury. Do it. Uh, I can... Tell you what, top yourself off with a basic crystal. Oh, shit. What's the name? Is still stoned. That's fine. Everyone's entitled to enjoy themselves. If she's stoned, does that count as her being dead? Will she not get the XP? Is it over already? Huh. Get a nice amount. No, I guess she will. Yes, that's fine. So being stoned doesn't count as being unconscious. That's cool. Okay. And we got a risen box. Cool. <laughs> and you have become my uh, my bridge. Nice. That was not bad actually. Um, I think we'll switch everybody else. Well, switch everyone back to their colours from now on. Okay, let's get out of here. Oh, listen to that. Yeah, watch your toes on the lava there. Okay, so do we have a gem here? I guess we do. Considering how much the controller is throbbing in my hand. Alright, so one gemstone. The red gem. One down, six to go. No, one down, five to go. Wow. So this is a moon crystal. It's so beautiful. I'm getting weak in the knees just looking at it. Moon crystal is the most concentrated source of energy that you will ever see. It was created by distilling a moonstone into its purest form. Oof. Moon crystals are pure energy. This crystal alone has the power of thousands, no, tens of thousands of moonstones. So this crystal is powerful enough to control one of those gigas. Geigers. Oof. Look at the light radiating from the crystal. Even though thousands of years have passed, the destruction of the old world, the crystal still shines as bright as ever. Between the power of these crystals and the destructive forces of the Geigers, it's easy to see how so much of the world was destroyed. It's so sad. The people of the old world had so much power, but they used it to make weapons instead of helping each other. Hmm. Very apt, yes. There's no way we can let Valua get their hands on one of these. Vina, leave it up to us. We'll keep it safe. The Valuans are going to have to take it off my dead body before I hand it over to them. That's the spirit. There's so much of the world that I still have to see. I'm not going to let them... Let them wake... So, oh, I was going to say, is that a typo? It's not a typo. Let them wake some ancient guardian to destroy half of it now. 
Thank, Thank you, Vase. I know you will do your best to keep it safe. You received the red moon crystal. It's us against the Empire. Okay. Well, I don't think there's anything else to be had in here. I think we've pretty much mined this place out. In fact, I'm almost certain of it. Right, let's go. Back to our little ship. Where our friend is waiting for us. Oof, glad to be... Well, glad to see the back of that place. Not a bad dungeon, actually. Not too bad. I think we do need to start levelling, though. I do wonder just how powerful we actually are. Let's go. I wonder if our friend's going to betray us. I actually honestly can't remember how this goes down. I have no idea. It's been so long. Belle, sorry to have kept you waiting for so long. I hope you weren't too worried about us. I'm so glad you're all right. Did you find the moon crystal? Yeah, of course we found it. I knew you could do it. Um, would it be all right if I took a look at it? Wow, so this is one of the legendary moon crystals. It's more beautiful than I ever imagined. Thank you so much. I'm sure that Lord Glacian will be very pleased. What? What are you talking about? <laughs> Let me show you. You silly fool. Bow, who are you? Instant transmission. Let me reintroduce myself. I am Belezia, the fourth admiral of the Imperial Armada. I specialize in covert operations. You didn't need to get your hands... You don't need to get your hands bloody to win battles. Sometimes a little trickery goes a long way. You, you tricked us! Alina? Or, um... <laughs> you're getting a little bit confused there, Fina. So everything that you said about your parents, about what, your childhood? Was it all a lie? Did you just say that to get to us? To get us to trust you? I told you the truth. I never said my father was from the Tsar. He was a Valuan soldier. He did die in battle. Years later, I too became a soldier. I want to put an end to all war, so nobody has to go through what I went through. Oh, so noble. <sighs> Countries go to war arguing over borders and resources. If the world was united under one rule, there'd be no more war. That is why we need the power of the Gigas to make sure nobody opposes us. Valua must rule the world. Um, no. No, don't! Uh-oh. Red Gigas. Uh, Recumen. As a bearer of the red moon crystal, I command you to awaken and do my bidding. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. She, she got it done it. She did the thing. Um, Fina, what did she do? This is bad, right? Uh, Recumen. No, no, she, she can't be. Goodbye, handsome. Oh dear. Rikumen, I command you, engulf these three in your flames. Peace through superior firepower, I suppose. Uh, yeah, this is bad. This is very bad. FaZe, Ika, hurry, we must run. <laughs> What's going on? Isn't it obvious, FaZe? I mean, come on. Belle, she, she's summoning Rikumen, the Red Gigas. She's using the power of the Red Moon Crystal to awaken him. Oh no! Yes, this is bad. She what? I guess we're gonna have to run. Hey, Kofina, let's get out of here. Okay. Yeah. Well, we don't really have anywhere to run to, though, do we? 
Not really. Kind of shit out of luck. Uh oh. And we broke the temple. I mean, technically we didn't break the temple. Is that... Oh boy. Yeah, these things are like the divine beasts, basically. From uh, Zelda, Breath of the Wild. Yeah, that's the Red Gygus, Reckumen. So those weren't statues in front of the temple, they were its heads. It's looking at us, run! Yep. <laughs> Oh, seriously, Fina? Fina! Fina, are you alright? Come on, we gotta go. I'm sorry, I tripped. I got Fina, take cover! Ooh. Something just shot it in the back of the head. Which made it miss. Oh, this is intense. It missed. Something hit it in the head. I can't leave you three alone, can I? Stop gawking and get on. Captain! Captain, you came back for us. Hurry, maybe we can take that thing out. In the Little Jack. Yeah, um, I think the Little Jack is slightly undergunned. Now, we have missed an item that would have made this much easier. Admiral Belezia, that ship is rescuing them. Ready the links. I want to make sure they don't escape. Yes, Admiral. <laughs> well, handsome, now we can see what you're made of. We need to put her to the sword. Captain, you came back for us just in time. I didn't come back for you. My search for Rackman brought me back to this desert. And I wasn't about to watch the three of you get roasted by that uh, thing. Hey, Fina, get a load of the captain. Wonder how long he can act like he doesn't care about us. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> Iko, you really shouldn't tease him like that. Who's acting? I just want to find Ragnan. Rotten little brats always getting me into trouble. <laughs> calm down, calm down, captain. But what should we do about that thing? Uh, well, let's just treat it like a practice run for when we finally do fight Ragnan. That thing packs quite a punch. Don't get hit by that beam, no matter what. I don't know if the little Jack can take a direct hit. Aye, aye. Aye, aye let's go. Okay. Drachma has joined your party. So, here we go. One of the main bosses of the game. Oh, dear. This thing looks really fugly. Hey, Captain, do you have any idea how to fight this thing? Hmm. You know about as much. Of, you know as much about this thing as I do, boy. Just stay up high and see what he does for now. Okay. So, best thing to do, really. Let's start focusing. We want some, and then we can't use that. How many points do we need for that? I can't remember. But what we'll do, we'll guard. Let's just charge. God, this was so epic back in the day. Look at that thing, though. Assessing damage. So this is one of the uh, gigas. It makes you wonder how on earth this ship could actually go toe-to-toe. -to -toe. Considering the six of these almost destroyed the world before, you know... Causing the Moonstone rain. So it looks like it's going to obsess its damage and then it's going to attack. So we're just going to charge. Hopefully we can use our main gun. Preparing attack. Okay. Right, 
let's go for some evasive action. Red Ray. Ooh. Yeah, that hurt. I mean, it wasn't too bad, but it definitely hurt. What was that? A few more hits like that and we're done for. I, I can't believe it. I've never seen such destructive power before. Yeah. Um. Right. We need to be able to bring our main gun to bear. So let's hit it with the main cannon. We will... Go for some... Evasive action there, I guess. And let's just keep hitting it with the main guns. Should be able to use our primary weapon eventually. Missed. Great. Perfect. Just what we wanted. Preparing for an attack. I'm not sure what evasive um, maneuvers actually do. Does that reduce the amount of damage we take, or does it give us a percentage chance of, you know, the attack missing? I'm not 100% sure. But this red ray is not actually too bad. I mean, it's bad enough, don't get me wrong, but it's not too bad. Yeah, we could probably take four shots. The fourth shot would destroy us. 150 damage. Ooh, it's pitiful. Absolutely pitiful. Just unload everything. That was a little bit better. Now, attack damage is determined by who is actually firing. Determined by your power stat. Which is a tip that Chris gave me. What are we supposed to do to beat that thing? Captain, there has to be something we can do. Hmm, I don't know if we can destroy him, but perhaps we can avoid his attacks. If you remember when I taped, I mean, when I picked you kids up, I attacked it with my cannons and it threw it off balance. So what I'm thinking is, if we were able to concentrate our cannon fire right before it attacks, we may throw its aim off. I suppose it's worth a try. What have we got to lose? Let's give it a shot. Okay. So, how much, I can't remember how much we need. What we're going to do first is 4,000 HP. Let's, let's hit it with the main cannon there. Let's use a repair kit there. And we'll hit it with our main gun there. And that's going to take us down to 17. And we might actually focus on this turn. Because we're going to want to use our primary gun. Because that's going to be the only way we're going to be putting this thing down. But we do want to keep our ship up in the air. We're no use if we're crashing down to the ground burning. Right, that's not bad. 4,000 health back. So, it's preparing to attack. I'm not sure if you have to hit it on the turn that it's preparing for an attack. Or whether you have to hit it the turn before. Can't remember. I guess we're going to find out. Oh, didn't work. Oof, that hurt. That really hurt. Jesus. Okay. That was bad. It's almost as if it's Red Ray is getting more powerful. Um, right. What we're going to want to do here before anything, we're going to want to repair kit. Uh repair kit we want to unleash that and possibly grab another repair kit because we're really injured here let's see how this goes if 
Yeah, these um, boss battles as well, they really do take a while. Because uh, as you can see, it's not exactly fast. Now, I think that's one criticism I would have with this game. It's just how slow paced these are. They're good, they're fun, but they're very, very slow. Are we going to get a good hit? Ooh, I think so. Oh, it didn't actually do a huge amount of damage, though. Yeah, this is bad. But it did make it miss, which is good. That is very good. So you have to hit it, then, on its round that it's going to hit you. Okay, We're back up to full health. This is going to be a serious battle of attrition, though. Monstrously powerful thing. Yeah, we did it. We knocked it off balance. Yeah, but, well, doesn't look like we did any damage to it, though. No. I don't know how long we can keep this up. It just feels like we're only prolonging our own deaths. He's got to have a weakness. Uh, let's try attacking its feet. I'm pretty sure that's what we need to do. Try attacking its feet. They've got to be supporting a lot of weight. That might be its weakness. I do vaguely remember attacking its feet. Okay, so... Let's just... Considering we're... Pretty well stocked. Let's give it a couple of shots to its feet feet. Actually, let's take that one back. No, because that's a critical chance. Okay, let's just open out a whole salvo of cannon fire. Yeah, that seems to tickle it a little bit more, doesn't it? I really wish you could speed these up, though. Keep firing. No missing allowed. Uh-oh. Yep, it, it hit us. It hit us. How much damage? Oh, dude. Savage amount of damage. It didn't quite destroy us, but... As you can see, all these attacks so far have done nothing. Literally nothing. Preparing another attack, I think we're going to be going down. Ooh, 270, that's a little bit more like it. But here we go. This is going to be us finished, I think. Yeah, that's us finished. We're done. We are done. That's going to end this video as well. Ah, uh, never give up. Right, luckily we can just restart this. However, we're already on 34 minutes, so we're going to have to save this for the next video. Right, guys, thank you very much for watching, and as always, till next time.